Hey, 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 three days, three ways. The last episode we did was all about that March capsule wardrobe. You loved it. I loved it. It was so fun. So we're going to do it again, but this time we're talking about travel. That's right. We're going to put together a little capsule wardrobe for you. I've got eight fabulous apparel pieces, a few perfect accessories, and you are going to be out the door for that warm weather vacation that I know is on so many of your calendars. Let's get started. Look number one. This is your travel day look. So we all know what that means. It needs to be comfortable, it needs to be versatile, and it better be a knit. So we're gonna start with this fabulous splendid skirt. You're gonna see this come around again as a set. But for now, I'm training it like an alternative to that jogger. Yes, you can wear a skirt on the plane, gang. I mean, we are not climbing Mount Everest here, but we do want coverage, we do want stretch, we do want it to be easy. So what I love about this, slit for movement. You know what that means? Reaching and grabbing a kiddo over here to put something into that compartment, but really, I just want it simple. So elastic waistband here, pull on, easy peasy. I want a layer because you know planes, hot, cold, hot, cold, hot, cold. And this is probably the bulkiest piece I'm bringing, so I might as well wear it, save some room in that suitcase for souvenirs and fun things that I'm bound to find when I'm traveling. Underneath, I've got this fabulous muscle tee from Every Eve. You'll see it again, don't worry. And then, of course, hands-free. Crossbody bag from Claire V. Little pop of color here brings some interest and novelty to this look and the most comfortable shoes out there. I don't like sandals on the plane. That's a me thing for sure. I don't like my toes exposed. So I wear my little no-show socks and my Saucony sneakers. Let's get on the plane and get to our destination. Next look coming up. Lock that muscle tee, pop down the matching set top and let those toes be free, got off the sneakers, popped on a Burke. So here's the deal, a simple set. This kind of acts like a dress, but gives you so many more options, which is the reason that I love it. Again, a little knit. So from Splendid, this tee, this is a little bit more of a French terry gang, so it's a little bit weightier than your typical t-shirt fabric, which I love because it kind of holds you in. This t-shirt, give yourself a little bit of shape. Do yourself a favor. Do a half tuck, tip from Ashley Lindsman, I love it. Kept on my Claire V bag, and yep, popped on those Burks. There we go. I see sightseeing in my future, kind of knocking around with the kids, exploring the city wherever we might be going. I've got a look for it. Okay, new way to style this, coming up next. Bonus look, you know what happens on vacay. You wake up. Maybe the first day, coffee, coffee. And if you are staying somewhere that does not have sufficient supplies, you're gonna run out and get yourself some libations for the morning to get your day going. Cause let's be honest, the first night anywhere new, especially with the fam is always a little rough. So we're gonna take that same fabulous tea from the set. Now we're treating it like separates. Pairing it back to, oh yeah, just like a Burke, everybody needs a great cutoff in their travel capsule. So I popped that on, back to the Burke, and then my secret sauce weapon, a little market tote. Now here's the deal. I took that great Claire V crossbody, lost the strap. I'm gonna treat this like a clutch. I'm gonna treat it like a crossbody, and I'm gonna treat it like an oversized wallet for all the things in my market tote on this trip. How fabulous is that? This can hold a ton of stuff and it takes up zero room in your bag. So it is a must have staple. There you go, off to get coffee. We're gonna have a good day. Okay, new look coming up. Let's go to the beach. Here's the deal. So much love for the fancy cover-ups that I see out there in the world. I try to be real when I'm going on a trip and because I like to bring just a carry on if I can, ugh. Sometimes I make sacrifices and cover-ups I have found are one of the things that I kick to the curb when it's a family vacay. Girls trip, oh yeah, I make all the room for that. But when it comes to a family vacation, I want pieces I can mix and match. So I go a little bit more casual when I think about what I'm layering over my suit. So we're going with a graphic tee and back to that fabulous cutoff because you never know where you're going after the beach. 
In my house, it's typically to get ice cream and I wanna be a little bit more covered up. So taking this fantastic sundry tea. Now what I love about this is that it's a graphic, but it's grown up. Little hit of color here in this washed down blue. So fun, this would also be adorable. Back to that splendid skirt. A little kind of mix and match with all those coastal colors. Back with my A Goldie gang. Remember, this is the Parker Long. And the reason we love it, because it's long. Little bit more coverage. And that is definitely a thing that is happening in cutoffs this spring and summer season. We're getting some length. And then a simple little slide. This is a fun, splendid slide. Why I love this. It's barely there but incredibly versatile. So this is one that I can dress up or dress down. Back to that market tote, threw my towels in, over my shoulder, swimsuit underneath, and I'm ready to go. Dinner out, but we're not going too crazy elevated, but we wanna feel put together, and this is such an easy dress to wear. Now, did you miss out on the denim version because it was here and gone in a flash? This is the new version in this yummy, yummy, rich terracotta color. And I'm gonna be honest, I kinda like it more. I think it's just a little bit more of a step up and gives you something different in that suitcase. So here's the deal, flap and stone, dreamy, dreamy soft, and a whole bunch of drape. I think this guy runs true to size. It's meant to be a little bit relaxed. Kept those same splendid sandals on. Oh, there's that Claire V bag, treated like a clutch and then my fabulous cloth and stone top. Now, I am not great about packing that jewelry roll with all the options for trips, so I like to keep it simple. This necklace does it for me. It's a triple strand, it's stacking, it's done. I can wear it everywhere, including to the pool because it's plated and it's not going to tarnish. Another look coming up, this is a fun one. Hold tight. You can't go on a warm weather vacation without a great white jean and uh, Bonus, if you're gonna get a white jean, it's gonna be comfortable, and here it is. This is the A Goldie Fran. Why do I love this? Well, number one, it's not meant to be tight. I always think that's so hard with white jeans. Why can't they make them more relaxed? Oh, wait, they did, and here it is. A Goldie, meant to be a little bit more of a relaxed fit, gang, so this is just leaning into that dramatic denim trend, doing it in white with this fabulous cuff. Now, white. What do I always say? Go up a size. And this one, I wore my true size. It feels really good because it's meant to be easy breezy. Feels like a fun way to have a little bit of a mimosa, some bacon, I don't know, an omelet and talk and catch up on vacation. Cause it's your trip too. It's not just about the kids. It can be about you. So here's the deal. Brought out that great Nora Muscle tee. I love this. It's a little bit more relaxing, so I did go down a size in this one. Back to the Fran, and here is the secret sauce in making a monochromatic look chic. Add some fun accessories. So, back to that stacked necklace, woven belt, splendid sandals. See what I mean? Dress up, dress down. There is that market tote with my Claire V bag inside. If I wanted to get really elevated, lose the market tote, grab the Claire V, I can treat it as a clutch or a crossbody, works either way, but we're gonna have some fun, okay? Ooh, so good. Okay, one more quick look coming up, and then let's get out of Dodge and go on a trip. So when I head on a warm weather vacation, I always try not to jinx myself, but the reality is you might have a day where the weather's not cooperating. Bring yourself a few pieces that can layer up. Gang, Faraday, stretch on this one, which is why I absolutely adore it. It's such an easy pack. It's not a rigid denim jacket. It almost feels like a denim shirt, but with 10 times more stretch in it. Generous, meant to be oversized. I went down a size. Popped back on that graphic tee. Little pop of blue. I love how that brings this denim jacket together. Kept on my belt. See what I mean about this kind of finishing off and polishing the look. There's that white denim. And then back to the Burks because comfort, comfort, comfort. I could have easily also done that great Saucony sneaker. You could also easily wear this home on the plane. Yes, you can wear white denim on the plane, especially if you're going home because who cares if they get dirty because you're going to throw everything in the wash anyway. Just the giant suitcase dump. Hope you're heading somewhere where the sun is shining or you're doing a little staycation at home and you're just thinking about how to build up that wardrobe. Got the options for you. Don't let them go because they are all going fast. We will see you soon.